trying to hit the drag strip on Friday afternoon or evening uh, so far with the car we've got the oil leak sorted out windshield's been replaced even though it's picked up already got a little crack going on from picked up a rock uh, got the wider tires in the back now some 17 by by eights uh, 235 45 17 uh, hopefully the one two shift should be a little easier to control I'm going to put together a toolbox, uh, some s small kit just in case I have to tighten up some stuff or repair some small things at the track. It's not, not going to bring a whole lot of stuff, just probably enough to put the belt back on if it falls off and tighten some hoses up. But yep, so that's the plan. Uh, I got the car all cleaned out, even mounted the ECU and some relays inside the glove box. The glove box is falling apart, so all that should be set up, ready to go for Friday night.
except for the converter not locking. I was still seeing just under six grand on the shifts. Uh, I was turning like 5,600 and change through the traps. Uh, took a Mustang's money on that one. Thank you. Oh man, 12-2 at 116. Let's go. <laughs> All right, so after that third run, uh, freeze plug started leaking everywhere. So I lost most of the water out of the motor. So figure out how we're gonna get home, but uh, pretty excited, we're on 12.2. Uh, made quite a bit of power, pretty happy with it. So I think get all the freeze plugs sorted out and make sure they're all good. And then we'll uh, come back out here maybe in a couple weeks when they have another Friday night or a Wednesday night and uh, see if we can do, uh, see if we can run like a high 11, who knows. Uh, I'll go back and look at the data logs and see if there's some gains I think that could be made. I think I could throw a little bit more timing at it. I was only seeing like 24 degrees of timing. Air intake temps were pretty high, like 220 at the end of the top of third gear. I also changed the way the transmission's interacting with this whole setup where uh, I don't lock the converter at the top of second and the top of third. I just set a value that I'll never get to, so it never locks the converter. And that seems to be working pretty good. Uh, that, I went through the traps at like 5,600 RPM instead of 5,000 RPM. So I think that's where some of our speed came from. And also in mid-track, uh, ran a 797 in the eighth, which is like the fastest has ever gone in the eighth. So, all right, thanks for watching. Well, so here we are getting towed home. Buddy Chris met me out of the drag strip. Kind of help me out here, tow the car back to the house, sort out some freeze plugs tomorrow, Sunday, try this again in a couple weeks.